Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything, for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Locked. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. Damn, there has to be food for you somewhere. I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. What the hell is this? Ugh, gross. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. What is going on here? Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals? Holy shit. This is so creepy. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next, a tornado? You don't think it could be, like, climate change or something? Climate sure has changed around here. Just saw that Prescott brat having a fit by himself in the parking lot. Isn't he always having a fit? He ain't the only one. If you knew what was going on with the fish around Arcadia Bay. Sorry, I'm too pissed to talk about it. See you around, kid. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next, a tornado? I heard that something bad was happening to the fish in Arcadia Bay. Well, since you mentioned it first, there ain't no fish in Arcadia Bay. <laughs> what? Come on. None? None worth catching and eating anymore. I'm not shitting you. Salmon, trout, bass have died and migrated. Even the damn clams are dying. Oh my god. But what about... Sorry, it's too salty to talk about it. See you around, kid. Like I said, I'm done talking about this. I'd love to do a whole... Big rig photo series. Hey, no photo girl. That would be cool to be a trucker for a while. Always on the road. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. 
That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? Hell, even that shifty Rachel What's-Her-Face asked me once if I'd drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Hey, how's it going? Peachy, interview over. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel? She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those... you know who know what's. Good riddance. But... You can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. Let's talk about my photo shoot later. 10-4. I made the trucker happy, and I get to photograph this bitch in 1977 Needham. That's a big 10-4, Max. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals? Holy shit. Look at that. It's so sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. So ominous. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. <sighs> nice world. Hi, how are you? I remember you. I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. Kate Marsh. I was able to actually talk her down from the roof. That was you? Well, if I had a bottle, cheers. Thanks. Wish I had a bottle for you. But I need to find out who else is involved in this. I'm probably a bigger snoop than you. People pretend to not see me. So I see everybody. And everything. Frank Bowers knew Rachel. Have you seen him around? I heard him bragging that he took a gun from some trespassers. I don't know how he hasn't been arrested yet. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. <coughs> Thanks for that storm warning, Max. And, uh, I'll let you know if I find out anything.
it will be fun to take a road trip to the drive-in with Warren. Max needs more fun. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. Looks tasty, but my need for keys comes first. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. But that doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns. No, but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Dr. Hador. Will your team know more after their latest tests? I hope we see more patterns, which gives us an atmospheric template. Many local residents of Arcadia Bay have been questioning what has been going on with this crazy weather. We had an eclipse yesterday, a snowstorm two days ago, which, as most of you know, is not common this time of year. It's unprecedented, to be honest with you. Uh, the last time that we had a snowstorm of this caliber was over a hundred years ago. All of us are questioning what is happening in Arcadia Bay. Please feel free to call in and let me know what your experience has been. What you think this might be is this global warming. What is causing all of this crazy weather? The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. You'd never know how weird this town is by these postcards. You should have jumped, asswipe. Shit. What are the other signs then? Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. What the fuck now? Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother, but I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. I could chug this beer, or dump it on Frank. Beer is gross, so... I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you! Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of Beans. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans! <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. 